How's it going everyone? My name is Gabe and welcome back to another Minecraft tutorial video and in this video I'll be showing you guys how to get rid of the player offline issue that so many people have been having when making a money scoreboard for their Minecraft from a world. I'm going to quickly show you guys how to get rid of it so that you don't have any player offline spamming up your screen and a lot of people mention that when people leave their money resets for some reason. So yeah this video will fix both of those issues and if this video does help you guys out don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. So as you can see on the right side of the screen it says my name on top and then it says player offline because the second Second player I have in this world is not online but once they join you can see that their name is back on the money scoreboard and it's just annoying that every time they leave it says player offline and it just stays up there the whole time you're playing but yeah I'm going to show you guys how to fix that let me get rid of my contraption really quick all right so the first thing you want to do is make your objectives now the first command is going to be slash scoreboard objectives add and after this you just want to put money display just like this capital M capital D and then after that just put dummy D U M M -M -Y, and then just hit enter and on the top left of the screen you can see it says add a new objective money display successfully the next command you want to do is pretty much the same thing with a different objective it's slash scoreboard objectives add money dummy and then after the dummy is when you want to get fancy with it you could make a unique name that shows up on the scoreboard like for me it was a green money so it was sauce a sauce l money just like that you could do coins if you want you could do dollars or something whatever you want to do but for me i'm going to be doing sauce a sauce l money and remember exactly how you spell this objective name because you're going to need that name in a command block so once you have your name picked out just hit enter and on the top left of the screen it should say add a new objective money successfully and if you want to double check that you have them both made just do slash scoreboard objectives remove and on the bottom left of the screen it should say money and money display now the next thing you want to do is add a ticking area to your minecraft realm and world and to do that do slash ticking area add circle tilde 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 four and then after this you can name it whatever you want i'm just gonna name this scoreboard and hit enter and once you have that made it should say added ticking area centered at your location with a radius of four chunks and currently i have four out of ten ticking areas in use but that's because i just have so many ticking areas in this world and if you don't know what a ticking area does for your world pretty much it makes your command blocks have infinite range in your world and the reason why a lot of people have their money reset to zero for these scoreboards they make is because they don't have a ticking area so make sure you add one of those the next thing you want to do is slash game rule command block output false and the reason why you want to do that is because if you use a repeated command block it will spam up your chat with just saying one thing at a time so you're going to want to add that game rule command because again if you don't it'll just spam up your chat with commands but the next thing you want to do is give yourself a command block so do slash give your name command underscore block and i spelled that wrong there you go command underscore block and you receive one you also want an observer and you also want a redstone and you also want a redstone comparator as well next with your command blocks is you want to place them three in a row like this one two three make sure that they're stacked and make sure they're all facing the same way or the arrows facing the same direction one two three blocks over and you want to go one two three again just like this and again make sure your command block arrows are facing the exact same way because if they are not facing the same way it won't work and so many people have had issues where they place them wrong like this and one of them sideways that just won't work so make sure that they are always facing the same direction the next thing you want to do is grab your redstone comparator go to the right side and you want to place it down just like this so that the arrow is facing towards the middle and then you want to grab your redstone observer and you want to go from this left side and you want to place it like that so that the eyes are facing the redstone comparator and for your redstone don't place it yet just wait until after you do your command blocks so starting on the bottom right this one is going to be a repeat unconditional always active command block and this command input is going to be test for at a and that's the simple command right there once you back out of command it should look, look purple that should light up and it says in the previous output found gabe dollar because i am in this world the second command block is going to be a chain conditional always active and this one is going to be scoreboard players add at a money zero once that command block is done you want to go right here to this third one this one's going to be a chain conditional always active and this one is going to be execute at at a run scoreboard players operation at p money display equals at p money just like that and it looks like one of my friends finds stingray is in my game i don't know what he's doing here but he's here but yeah this command block should be good and now you want to go on to the bottom left side of the command you want to make this one a impulse unconditional needs redstone and the command input is going to be scoreboard objectives remove 
money display just like that second command block is going to be a chain conditional always active and this one is going to be scoreboard objectives add money display dummy and after dummy is where you want to put that fancy text that you made when creating the scoreboard objective so if you remember i did sauce a sauce l and money just like that whatever you named it in the beginning of the video that's where you're going to want to put here but once you have that done then you can back out of that command block and the last command block is going to be a chain conditional always active and this one is scoreboard objectives set display sidebar money display and once you have that done, you are now able to put your redstone down like this in the middle. And on the right side of the screen, you can see that it says money. It has my name and it has Stingray's name. As you can see, I joined with my alt account, Gabe MMI, and it says his name on the scoreboard as well. So it automatically shows that he's in here. And if he leaves the game just like this, it'll say player offline for like a split second and then it'll remove him from the scoreboard, which is great because now I don't have any player offline issues. And if you want to add money to your friends or yourself, all you want to do is do slash scoreboard players add your name or anyone else's name and then do money and then you could type in any kind of number so i'm gonna do 1515 and as you can see i have 1515 money i could do it for stingray scoreboard players add stingray money and then 1515 as well and then if you want to remove it just do slash scoreboard players remove my name money and then as much money as you want so i'll remove a hundred dollars and now i have 14 15 money but anyways that was the video guys and if you guys did enjoy don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to the channel and if you guys want to join an amazing community definitely join the discord it will be linked in the description below but before i go youtube is recommending this video to you guys from my channel so i recommend you guys go checking it out because you guys will love it at least i hope so but anyways my name is gabe and i'm out peace